What are we picking here in this vintage cube draft? Mox. Tomo? Definitely you're, Mox. You ever take two turns in a row? Please play Necromancy instead of Buried Alive again. That was a great video. Happy mm. birthday, Mooch the <clears throat> Booch. Mooch the Booch. Happy birthday, my dude. God, man, Michael gets so old, doesn't he? Like 187. Thousand. I'm going to take Giver of Runes. You dare me to let it go? Please don't. Giver of Runes sucks. What? If you had the time walk and Mox Ruby? Yeah. It's definitely Mox. Wow. Don't agree with that at all. At all? No. You ever take another turn? It's okay, but a lot of times it's just meh. Wait till I get Snapcaster Mage. <clears throat> you not. Wow. How about a Daze? You like Daze? Uh, uh, sure. Do you? It's all right. What do you like? What does Michael like? I'll consider taking the Arid Mesa. Oh, the Arid Mesa. That's good. The Arid May You don't like getting them? You don't like the getems and the gotems and the goodems? I said it was fine. Well, Batter Skull. Nah, I don't want that piece of trash. Well, here you're a blade hold. <clears throat> what about tendrils when we go in storm? But then our time walk sucks. Time walk's in useless. storm? Yeah. No, it's it terrible. Ain't. You take an extra turn, you lose all your storm count. It's terrible. You just take it and then you get another storm. And then you storm the next turn, Michael. That's not how that works. Yes, it is. You literally play it and then you get to draw another card and take another turn and play another land. So if you need one more turn to go off, you just play the. This. I hate you. Let's take the days. I took it. We're storming, bitch. <laughs> We're storming, boy! <laughs> okay. Yogg wasn't going to come back. You ready? I hope she does. The high tide would be way more easily tabled than the will. I don't know why you took the. I don't think that's true at all. Really? I like Coalition, really. My high tide's only good in Storm. Will has some. No, slight... Will is not good in any other deck, dude. <clears throat> no one's playing Will. I didn't forget the intro. I chose to do a. Short thing. A short thing. Is it this? Yeah, I think so. Or is it Past in Flames? No, it's. Or is it Warm Power Stone? It actually might be Warm Power Stone. Is this just a better Warm it's Power just Stone? It's better. Alright. Warm Power Stone comes to play tap. Nailed it. We're doing it. <clears throat> Live in the dream. Oh, dream's dead. The dream is dead. There's literally nothing in this back. Take a free booter. <coughs> Brain freeze. Now we have all the stormals. Mm -hmm. No, still empty the horns. <coughs> hey, man, you need a cough drop? No, I'm not, I'm not, I don't have a cough. Hmm. Flum and cough are different things. You need a flum drop? Yeah, give me a flum drop. Well, let's take the ultimate pricey. Let's go for the throw, man. Whatever. They're like the same thing. <coughs> They're not. <coughs> they do similar things. Oh. Oh, Mox didn't come back. <laughs> man, nothing in here. Maybe we're just an ab maybe we're just an Esper deck. I mean, the only cards we wouldn't really play are these two. These, these actually. Oh, the Yogmoth didn't come back. That's some bull honky. Well, we got a different Yogmoth. And none of these matter. Ooh, look at a little Terramander. Look how aggressive we are. Now we got Rival Master Terramander. Ophiomancer. It's basically just won the game. Got him. Oh, Mana Crypt? Yeah. That's a good one. Maybe that Wheel of Fortune comes back. <clears throat> Mox. 
Ooh, Brawl. Is that a vampiric theater? Like Brawl's better than vampiric theater. Really? Yeah, it makes everything cheaper. How is this? How is this not better than this? This turns on the removal. Yeah, but what removal? It's vintage cube, man. There's plenty of that going around. No, you 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 being dumb. I'm gonna take Scalding Tyrant. How do you like that? That seems good. All right, nailed it. I'm gonna take Necrotal. No, I'm just kidding. I wasn't gonna do that. We Salamander. Mana Leak? Thran Dynamo? Thran Dynamo. I'm going to take Pack Rat as a backup. What? No, we ain't doing that. Thran Dynamo's not really good in Storm either. Oh, but Warm Power but Warm Power Stone was going to be? No, that's why I told you to take the Relic. I hate him so much. <clears throat> Someone kill him. I definitely love looking at Barrack Tutor is way better. Um... I mean, tutoring is super important in this kind of deck. I mean, we have Dark Petition. Like, everything costing one less is more important. Like, your your mana is where is the thing you want, which is why High Tide is so important. It's why Time Spiral is so important. Like, Storm is literally trying to cast as many spells as possible. And, like, when all of your spells cost one less, it's a lot easier to do that. Oh, Mystical Tutor. See, you're just going to get this one anyway. Or Electromancer. Ooh, I like an Electromancer. Hmm. Yeah, I think it's Electromancer. This, actually, this will probably come back. We're going to take the Mystical Tutor. And we're going to try to get that Goblin on the wheel. You ever seen a Goblin on a wheel? I've never, I've never have. <clears throat> Beautiful steam vents. Beautiful steam vents. I think it's just creeping tar pit. Yeah. It doesn't have blue though. It doesn't have it's not an island though. True. Whatever. It's I think we're it's better than ultimate price here, so Thief of Sanity, I guess. As a backup, you okay man? What is this what is this you're doing? Just my side area. Your side area? Yeah. What does that mean? I don't know, man. You don't know what the thing you said means? It's like some part of my body. I don't know. What is? <clears throat> the thing that's in pain. Oh, well, you never mentioned the pain part. I thought we've been over this. What? No, we went over what? Why do the side thingy? Is it, has it occurred to you that you might live an unhealthy lifestyle? Never. Yeah, he was. I knew he was gonna. I was like, "Here comes a sarcastic answer," because he doesn't like he doesn't like uh, acknowledging the truth. That's not true, and you know it. I acknowledge the truth all the time. Do you? Yes. When? Name one time you did. <laughs> Tuesday. Did you Tuesday? Who knows? Well, I figured you did because you said it. Our storm deck's not looking great, guys. No, it's not. We got so we got all the storm pieces, so I don't know what other people are taking, but come on, Electromancer. Yeah, boy. All right, our storm decks. Now we have a threat. Now we're live again, boys. Yeah, Channeling's actually fine with the uh, tundrals. <clears throat> yeah, it's like two triggers in one. It's almost like it gives you two storm. That's, that's what I said. I literally just said that. Not specifically. Yes, I did. It says two triggers and one. Two storm triggers. You didn't say storm triggers. You just said two triggers. What did you, what did you think I was referring to? What triggers did I mean? I'm just getting technical. Preordain's very good, but so is Lotus Bloom. I, I think it's I think it's Bloom. Yeah, that card's impressed me more and more in Storm. Going on down to Rat Train. This pack is not storm friendly. I might just take the Emrakul in case we get like through the breach or sneak attack. It was a show to tell the other pack. I know. Should have taken it. I know. I'm having all the regret. <clears throat> Kiki Jiki. This is another terrible pack. Jesus. Mm -hmm. 
The X. These packs are bad, dude. I don't think we have a deck. I don't think so I think either, we fizzled. Man. I guess take Kiki Jiki. I never like Gonti better than Kiki Jiki. Kiki Jiki does literal nothing. Okay. <sighs> Angrath's not. I don't care about Angrath. Time to start looking for playables in the sideboard. I mean, I wonder if we have, like, a terrible, like, Grixis mid-range kind of deck. Do you mean if it's terrible? Yes, the answer is terrible. The answer is terrible? Is the answer terrible, or is the deck terrible, man? Both. If we get a Narset, though, we're definitely playing that. You think a Narset's gonna go that late? Oh, boy. Rakdos, Signet, and Pestermite here. And we just passed Kiki-Jiki. What if that Kiki-Jiki comes back? I would take Pestermite. Over the signet, huh? Yeah. I feel like it's only out to having a deck. Light up the stage is interesting. We're never going to trigger spectacle, though. I would take sour or hero's downfall. Sour? Sir. Like a candy? Like a sour candy. Like reap what you sow? Yeah, reap what you sour. Interesting. Bring in Rattlemaster, Thief of Sanity, Freebooter, Ophiomancer, Tassigar, go for the throat. Cut the Mind's Desire, too. Oh, I forgot about that one, unfortunately. Uh, might just be Arena here. Uh, going on down to Rat Train. I mean, I don't, I don't <clears throat> think we need more, more removal. Like... I was thinking, like, maybe Walking Ballista, but... What does Walking Ballista do? It attack and block. Oh, does it? It attack oh. and protect. Probably better block. If I donate 10, will you drop? Probably not, because this is just... Like, it's fun to see what happens with the deck. Like, I... I don't think I have to have, like, some perfect deck in order to, like... I, and I'm also... It's also kind of challenging now, because I've won with... I feel like I've won with piles before, so... This is certainly a pile. Wow. Definitely better blossom. Storm Dream is dead. Oh, I like this guy. Sure. Yeah, that guy's fine. Oh, Chandra? Wow. Sure. Yeah. All right. We're doing it. Oh, Ravenous Choops. Yeah. And Grass Rampage. All right. Sure. Got a deck, guys. We got a deck. It's a little rough, but, you know. It's another Planeswalker removal. Mike B is a pile. What are you looking at here? I'm just looking at what all we got. In the deck? Yeah. 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 So we have a welder, but we don't have... Oh, Mind Slaver. Oh, we have Goblin Welder Mind Slaver now. But we only have, like, one other artifact in Coalition Relic. Yeah, I don't think that works out. But you could just play Mind Slaver. It's just fine on its own. Going on down to Rat Train. Michael B. Oh, Fatal Bush. All right. Sure. Isn't it really late where you are? Uh, it is currently 1.50 a.m. Ow! 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 kind of... kind of poop. And the Kiki-Jiki did not come back. don't hate this deck mm. or should we, I wish that Kiki wheeled that would have been great yeah, I this is kind of like a value I deck. almost think Terramander might be decent here what if we take out Mind Slaver and play like Terramander and Fatal Push how many spells is that? spells that would trigger it one two uh, I'm going to take out Pestermite three four five six Seven, eight. How's he working? 
Uh, adapt is four, costs one less for each instant or sorcery. So even if there's, uh, so it's like eight. Even if there's three, it just costs five. So I mean, like, okay, just makes like a five-five flyer. Yeah. Struck position worth it? Wait, what would we play instead? We can just play six, seventeen lands in Mana Crypt. Could play Time Twister. Eh. <laughs> mm. Yeah, it would be a Language deck. I wish we had a Fractured Identity. I mean, we can cast off Coalition Relic, but I don't think that's good enough. Nah. We could play Pestermind just kind of an Invasive Beater. I just, if we had Sword, I'd be more inclined to do that, but I just don't think he's very. I don't, I don't know. I think Dark Petition is poo poo here. Really? It just gets anything. I mean, we have instants and sorceries. It adds to Terramander, and it probably only costs two. I think mm -hmm. it's actually totally fine. Like, gets a Chupacabra, gets a Sower, gets a Gaunti. Alright. Just stop being a little baby about it. What about Baral? Is he worth it? <sighs> probably not, actually. Yeah, let's play Pestermite over Baral. I'd rather just play 17 lands in a Mana Crypt. But Mana Crypt reduces your... It's kind of like a land. Yeah, but it's not really, because, like... I mean, it's colorless, and we have a lot of color requirements, and also, like, I don't want to replace a land drop with a Mana Crypt. I'd rather have a, a land and a Mana Crypt. Okay. 7, 8, 3, 4, 5, 6, 4, 5, 6. Alright, let's see what we're adding. One more of black. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 1, two, three, four, five, six. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So 7, 6, 6. Some elf. Thanks so much for the gifted sub, buddy. Really appreciate it. And thanks so much for your, your resub. Which I think I did say. Um, the word, the word, the word, the word. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 4, 5, 6. Plus Coalition Relic. Not great, Bob. Just gonna add one more island. Alright, let's do it. Not great, Bob. I mean, we're probably gonna 3 0, so. It doesn't matter what goes, Mike goes better, Mike B. It is Mike B, Mike B. His name is Mike B. He lives in the trees. Mike B. Zip dee doo. It's okay, I got it all. <clears throat> oh, wait, we're keeping this? God, yeah, we're keeping this. I ain't going to six cards. What am I, a maniac, Michael? I hope he has an artifact, I guess. I do too, man. That'd be gas. Can you imagine? Like, they go, like, or Signet or something, and I'm just like, pa -pa! They didn't. They didn't, but they could. And we drew another land. Yeah, there's a lot of lands, man. I'm going to be honest with you. Play a sword or something. They're going to play a Yav My Elder or some bull honky. Dang it! <laughs> Red cards, am I right? Shoop on top. I've been catching your friend the last couple of Who's my friend? I don't even know who you're referring to. Uh, yeah, okay. Uh, one, two, three. Coalition Relic. Joke's on you. I don't even have any creatures. Oh, wow. They played a lot forest from their hand what I don't understand huh. you had the island on huh am I no that was just straight terrible sorry I, I just think I'm too stupid to understand this
Oh, it's your boy. One, two, crack, one, two. Yep, they should be fine. So, play an island. Thief. Our deck sucking is really good because that means our thief is better because, like, they're hopefully they'll have a really good deck and we can play their spells, you know? <laughs> Dark Confidant. I mean, oh look, they had the they had the second one in hand. Joke's on me. Well, See getting stung on the tunge sounds so horrifying. I guess we'll take it. What's happening right now? I. Why do you pay two for that? Well, because you sacrificed it. But I don't. Oh, it's two to pay. I thought it was only one. No, I'm wondering why they didn't kill my. <laughs> swamp, swamp. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. Island. Top. Oh, I guess because they have fatal push. So here is island choop swamp swamp island. So we know. F five of the six cards in their hand and four of them are lands okay well that's enough lands um, uh, or you know lands things things lands whatever we can get whatever we like Like Gonti, maybe? Well, we know they have tubes. Oh, yeah, that's true. I kind of like Chandra here. They have no pressure. Like, we just take two next turn. I'm half drunk and eating tacos. My typing skills is limited. <laughs> okay, borrower. You got it. Top is gone. Well, Brazen Bar is a little more awkward because of Chandra now. Hmm. No, well, guess nothing happened. Oh, they also don't have double blue? What? Well, they have an island in hand, right? No. Yes. What did they just do? Oh, they just played a swamp. Okay, so one swamp gone. Well, I have no idea what that is, but... Oh, that was a good one. Red. See you later, Den Protector. Come on, Mike B. Oh, I swear. Go to the graveyard. I killed all your things. Alright. So now we know they have Swamp, Choop. We know their whole hand now, right? Because the unknown card is Den Protector. Yes. And the last card they drew was the the top. So come on, Ali. There's an island. 
All right. They did not play anything. You're going to let me activate Chandra instead of bouncing the Chandra? That's interesting. Oh, I like this. We can Mystical Tutor. What are we going to put on top? Hmm. Do we care? Do we want anything? I guess not. Yeah, I think we should wait before they present something for us to Mystical Tutor for. It was a swamp. Creeping to our pit. I guess this deck is really good at killing stuff. Yeah, man, we're winning already. I don't know what the, I don't know what the problem is. Raisin bar or Mashandi. See him do that? I did. Unbelievable. I mean, it's not that great for them. Oh, I'm aware. <coughs> See, they have Island Tube Swamp. Tarpit is a messed up magic card. Nebraska. It's pretty good. Oh, it's a little snake man. Ooh, snake man. Let's get a time walk this time. Actually, I feel like it should have been Angrass Rampage, but I guess it's fine. Attack the queen. Come on, Mike B. Oh, what a swing. He likes cheese. Mm -hmm. They played an island, so we know they have Chupacabra and Swamp in hand. What's going on here? Just let it get hit. I'll lose the mana. I accept my fate. Ooh, that guy's gonna be big. One, two, three, four, five. I guess they have uh, Chupacabra, though, so that's... Well, they've yet to play it when they could have, so maybe they forgot it's in their hand. <laughs> you know, maybe. Well, when could they have? Oh, like earlier when we had... Yeah, when we had some guys. Thief of Sanity, sure. I don't understand what's taking so long. They only have Chupacabra and Swamp in hand. So I'm like, I don't understand why. There's so many decisions to be made. Look at that. Look at that thinking Mike B. <laughs> Well, 
that would have been good earlier, but I guess we'll take it. Should have played that pre-combat. What? Well, I guess they just block and. Well, I think it's block and sack, and we still got a guy out of it. So. Mike, can we get an IRL thinking Mike B? Oh, like the face? I don't know which one is you. Not none of them. Alright, there you go. Hmm. <laughs> it's perfect. Now I'm wishing I played Terramander. Because they're just going to kill the Rattle Master, so. Okay, they played Swamp. All these are gone. There's troops. Finally, jeez. Never, th I never thought I'd see the day, laddie. Laddie. I wish our opponent had an artifact that we could. Yeah, can't really kill that one. You might say that's not something that props can fix. Yeah, he's playing with a 2 1, trade with the tube. You might as well. Come on, Mike B. Get out of your tree. How much does it cost? Four? One, two, three, four. All right. All right. Guess I'll pass. Look at our, look at our mid-range tempo deck that's like, just doing it. We're just doing it. God, I hate top so much. It's just not even a fun card. Just take it out of the cube. Like the only, the only like, the only miracles you have is like, bonfire and terminus. Those are the only reason it's kind of okay in, in commander is because like people would do it preemptively. Yeah, like they'll be like, "While you're thinking, I'll top." Yeah, we were waiting for this guy. Now this guy costs three to pump. Oh, that's gas. Look, at that's exactly how much I have, Michael. Oh shoot, what's this? Something's happening here. I don't know what it is. Oh, that's a good one. Okay, but they don't have enough mana to activate here. What do we have? We got a Rabble Master, a Thief of Sanity, Corsair Dunpro Okay, nothing that's actually gonna like gonna wreck our face. See what we got now. Oh wow, that was very good. Jeez. How many chupacabra? <laughs> Jeez. Oh man. Our deck is so good, guys. <laughs> so good. I think Hex Mage is probably fine here. Anything else that we care about? Can we just get to Emrakul? Can we just cast it? No. Is it a beast? What is Chupacabra? A beast horror. Candy! I'll take the Shieldbreaker out and I'll bring in Hex Mage. We did see a Planeswalker and we did not see any artifacts that seemed worth it. It's true, you know. I don't know. I don't love this hand, but I don't hate it. Because at the very least, we can cast these two. Hopefully, that a blue and a red. Any red? Got this. Any blue? Got this. And we're on the draw. Our opponent is Deadpool. Did you know that? Huh. Yeah, I know, right? Now we can do any land and have a three drop. Not creeping tar pit, though. If you draw the next turn, we can. Oh. 
actually don't think I care about Hex Mage. I think I'd rather just keep up Mana Leak. Yeah, you can save Hex Mage for when it's relevant. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <sighs> it's a beautiful Hex Mage. Ba -da -ba. <sighs> definitely a Den Protector. It's definitely a Den Protector. I don't think I care about it, though. Get that steam vents that holds our whole deck together. <laughs> the glue that constructed our deck. A single steam vent. Well, I kind of like Freebooter here. Before Thief, yeah. But maybe not. No, I just want to. I just want to jam Thief. <laughs> Don't care. I ain't taking two turns off. Hopefully, it doesn't have Swamp Troop. This is a weird mana base for a deck that looked primarily green with like Corsair and Sakura Tribe Elder and Yavimaya Elder and Vraska. Uh, the team, I don't remember the, I don't remember Rattlecliver being in the Vintage Cube. It probably was though. Maybe in some iteration. Oh, I think they, were they going to Fatal Push there? What's happening? What the hell is that? Toxic Deluge for two? Wow, they just two for one? That's gasoline. Oh, let's get Rabs out. Let's yeah, seems like a good turn to do. Let's get big Rabs. If he doesn't have an answer, it's a lot of damage next turn. And even if they do, we can just... Oh, if, if their answer is like a creature, it's even better. Man, I thought Deadpool was more strategic-minded than this. Man, Thief of Sanity puts the fear in him. I mean, it's a pretty... Insane card if you let it on tap. Also, if they don't have anything, we just get to keep Mana Leak up and eventually Time Walk. Or we can Time Walk. Time Walk might just kill them, right? Like, Time Walk next turn if they don't have a creature is yeah, like... they get hit for six, and then you get hit for... One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, and then, then eight, right? Yeah. So, what is that? 14 damage, they go to three? Yeah, it's pretty good. Hey, that's pretty good. Okay, well, they didn't have anything, so let's... Do the thing. Hey, that's pretty good. <laughs> Jesus. This guy has a family, but where is it now? Nobody knows. Oh, they're just conceding. And now we just have Mana Leak back up. They're just basically dead. Yeah. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. They go to three. We can also kite sail freebooter, make sure they just don't have like. Well, like, like, what could they have though? They would have countered time walk for sure. Elder, carry added, Oko, Heroes Downfall, Animate, no, I don't care about any of these things. <sighs> I guess Oko is like the, it doesn't matter. Yeah, take the Oko, it's the most annoying. <laughs> it's not like they're going to play any of them anyway. Yeah, alright. I don't know what, I don't know why they kept this hand. With like five green cards in it. Well, 1-0 guys, 1-0. Basically on a 3 0, Michael. Looks like it so far. I told you, man, you play the terrible decks. That's how you win. <laughs> you should see the storm deck in my sideboard. <laughs> Maybe you get cute and play tendrils. I am the king of responsible keeps. What'd you say to me? Maybe you get cute and play tendrils. I mean, yeah, we'll just tendrils for two It's on certain turns uh, for you. I don't think either of my keeps in those games are responsible. This one's, I think this is a key. Yeah, I do too, I mean, actually. You don't have blue, but like... We're mono black, needed, but yeah. whatever. A little less conversation, a little more action. A little more Mike B, a little less Mike B. What? What does that mean? It's 
a lot of a lot of mono it was a mono black deck for sure. Man, it took a while there. They're like, oh, I'm gonna read this. Nicobolus Inkai is Dak Faden and Ashiok. <laughs> oh Christ. Their, their mana is like one, two, three. They're all three basics. They can play either planeswalker. I mean, Ashiok definitely scares me more. Yeah. Yeah, I'll just take Ashiok. Really, I was if this if either one of these were heroes downfalls, I'd be pretty grateful. I'll also take an island. More mono black cards. Okay, sounds good. What if Kite Sail Freebooter was like Hostage Taker and you can, uh. Play it? Yeah, you can cast it. That'd be very, very good. Oh my god. That'd be super broken. It'd probably be rare or mythic. Okay. Island. No Dak Faden. Fascinating. Well, that should help if they don't counter it. Sure. Man, everybody loves Ashiok. Well, another another mountain, another swamp, rather. Wow, <laughs> that's incredible. And we played seventeen lands. And a mana crypt here, so that's cool. Oh, two lands and a goblin and rabble master. If they could play more creatures, I'd really appreciate it. Nope, just stack fade. Well, we're definitely bringing in Vampire Hex Mage, that's for sure. Because it's basically a hero's downfall. If it makes you able to had the old turn nine, sell two lands with instant, that does not make me feel better. Why would other people's downfall misfortune make me feel better? I never understood that. That would not make me feel better. That would make me feel worse. <laughs> Solidarity. Inkwell Leviathan. Jesus. How, if this... How do I... I just can't, right? Right. I'm pretty sure you can't. That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. I guess it's just thirst. Let's just get thirsty. You doing okay? I'm getting real tired. It's like two o'clock. You literally just bragged about how you had two sodas, a five hour energy, and a fucking twelve shot Starbucks. Now they're you can't wearing, even make it till two o'clock. They're wearing off. How much did you sleep last night? Uh six hours. Five and a half maybe. Really? Yeah. What time did you go to bed? Five thirty? You went to bed at five thirty. What time did you wake up? Eleven? Like noon. And what'd you why what'd you do what's happening I just got up and I was just up you were just hanging out yeah huh ain't that something did they not activate Ashiok and by something I mean I was playing Fallout obviously 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 wow you got up early and you stayed awake at noon just to play Fallout no I just couldn't get them back to bed so I was like I might as well play Fallout Okay, hold on. We played this. They they activated Dak Faden. They drew two cards of Dak. Discarded, discarded. Played Talarian Academy, Gruel Signet, Thran Dynamo, and then they, they didn't activate Ashiok. Wow. Hey man, I got a new plan. I'll get five five iron energies, drink them all, and then I can stay away forever. Wow. <laughs> Actually, that would literally make you have a heart attack. 
Does. Did I have to work today? Yeah, I went to work. Full eight hours. Dude, I see the sun come up every morning usually. <laughs> right before I go to sleep. I actually almost care about this. Because that's their second block. I think it might be this game. It's, it's boring. <laughs> You're boring. Not not magic in general, just this particular game. I think this magic game is boring. <laughs> I've only spent who knows how much money on this game. Five nickels. Five s peppermint sandies. I used to have a, a very legit collection. God, listen to the humble brags on this guy. My collection was very legitimate. I went nuts when I learned about Commander, and I bought like a bunch of... I like used... Uh, the like the money you get back from uh, scholarships, like the like the extra money you get, I would just use it to buy magic cards. Should have bought Bitcoin, idiot. <laughs> yeah, I should have. <laughs> that would have been a much better investment. I definitely took a loss when I s sold all my stuff. So they haven't, oh, they discarded the Inkai, so now they have Nickel Bolas, but then we took away their second black source, so. Wow, they just hit Tasker and Opiomancer. That's impressive. Michael B is, if you drink 25 hour energies, you can reach Goku level power. You just have to not die. <laughs> Should we try it? Can we Amazon order 20 of them and see what happens? Wow. Well, we might as well get the extra strength ones, too. 20 extra strength ones? What is yeah. that? Six hour energy? I don't know. They're just called extra strength. I don't know how much more energy actually is. That's weird. How can they guarantee five hours of energy? They work, dude. Apparently they not. They keep you up. Listen to you, little baby. I had it at like two, at like 3, 4 p.m. 2, 3, 4 p.m.? It was like, yeah. Like, no, it was... Probably 6 p.m. That's what I drank. 2, 3, 4, 6 p.m. Good lord. <laughs> I don't even know what time that is, man. <laughs> Get your blocker out of my face. We're living in the shadows of the night. Our decks is like... Two two aggros, but not very aggressive. My concern is this Ashiok. Yeah, he's killing us. He's you tearing Lisa. You tearing me apart. I can't troop kill planeswalkers, buddy. I don't even know. I don't want to. Fuck. I don't want to use thirst. And I don't want to use Chandra's exile ability because, like, I guess we got one more hit with this guy, right? We're just plussing this until we can kill them. And they discarded that nickel bolus too, which is kind of funny. Or also, like, it deals five damage whenever you do something, right? Something ridiculous like that. Who is? Five yeah, yeah. Old. Every time you cast a spell, it deals five damage. Any spell? Any spell, yeah. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> that one's pretty, pretty easily. You can also just decide not to cast and do damage to Ashiok, right? Can't you do that? What did, they, what did she reveal? That. Island, okay. No, you can't. Uh, oh, no, that'd be great. This is an emblem where you cast a spell that targets one of our permanents. It doesn't really work. Because there's nothing really in cube that targets that doesn't bounce or destroy, so it's basically useless. I would just go after Ashiok. Yeah, I guess that's true. Like, there's really no pump spells in cube. It's gonna be a close one. Close one. What's your alt? Seven? Yeah. Okay, they hit the sower and two more lands. And they're deck fading themselves. Discarding Hangerback and Lava Claw. They played an island. 
one, two, three, four, five, six, worm coil. Jesus Christ. Just a little mog, hard cast a little mog. That is 11 mana. Walking Ballista? Bane Flat? What the fuck is this? It looked like an X spell, although they were adding mana, so it might just be Walking Ballista. 4, 5, 7, 8, 9, 10. Oh, I think they realized they paid an odd number for their Walking Ballista. Yeah, there you go, you figured it out. Yep, that's hard to deal with. Oh. Cool. Yeah, that's fun. <clears throat> Alright, let's take out the go for the throat. Let's take out the chups. I almost like brain freeze the number of cards they're drawing. Just like get cute on one turn and get them? Yeah, just get them. Mind Slaver also seems pretty decent here. They got the Sower. Like, they seem to have like zero creatures except for like an Ink Eyes. Yeah. Oh, I'll take out Fatal Push. Yeah, that's pretty bad. Getting Pestermite is just a. I was thinking that too. A thingy. Probably just play it. We got like 18 mana sources. Sure. Go red. We got a pretty serious clock. Look at all these value cards. Yeah, I don't feel comfortable splashing Fractured Identity off of one Coalition Relic. They mulled to six. They're basically dead. Yeah, totally. Deb, have a good night, buddy. Appreciate the support, my dude. Preach. Oh, that's, that's good if they don't have an answer for that guy. They always have an answer. God, it's so rare to connect with the Thief of Sanity. Nope. You okay? Scratch that belly? Mm -hmm. Scratch that belly. Oh, Bone Shredder that can't attack or can't kill this. That's fascinating. paying for it. Wow, that's crazy. I was going to tap down one of their lands, but apparently they're doing the hard work for me because now I want to tap down their Pester Mine. Or their Bone Shredder, rather. And if we draw a red, we can just go Angrass or Rampage and make them sack their their girl sing what are they doing I'm really having trouble figuring this like out. come on dude what what are you doing are you having a stroke all right now i will tap your land tap the academy oh. well academy only makes one but i mean i guess if they play I mean, another artifact yeah right exactly i wanted to keep them off double black and double blue so Oh, now we get to just sack our Pestermite. Wow, that worked out quite well, actually. 
Come on, red. That's not a red, but it does give us a... Uh, well, let's actually hold off. Let's see what we hit first. Dynamo gives us a lot of mana. It does. I don't think we're playing it here, though. No, it's probably just better play arena. I mean, they're just going to go Nickel Bolas, kill our... I guess they can't with the Gruul Signet, though. Yeah, they need another mountain, right? No, they only need one red, but they need another, they need another black. Sure, you got a Gaunti and Chandra. That's sad. Oh, that's nice. Now we can just kill the Ash Yawk if we want. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. Chain Lightning and just attack it. Well, I was going to Angrath Rampage it. Oh, that works too. Actually, well, let's see what our options are. Hmm. I kind of like getting rid of this because it shuts off this too, but Ashak might be a problem. I guess, no, I guess next turn. We'll take one more hit from Ashok, but it'll be at seven. So we can actually go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Do you really want to get a Gaunti against us, though? No, not really. I think we just kill it. They'll have three mana, though. Red is definitely our bottleneck here. I take out Gruul Signet, and they only have Underground Sea Island Swamp. I think that's actually pretty good. I don't know if I care about Gaunti as much. Okay. Yeah, I just think it's better. Play land. I'm just going to Impulse here first, actually. Let's see what we get. If we can get... The shield mage, I'll just play that. Oh, wow. One, two. This takes care of everything. Any order. Sack an artifact. Happy holidays. And the Gaunties are ringing. Happy Gaunty days to you. We uh, can also tar pit. Yeah. Or, or to tar pit and all right, my dude. So Ashiok, Ashiok, your face. Oh yeah, that's what we're talking about. Right, we could have cast the impulse with with dynamo mana, but I'd rather have the mana because I want to see what I'm getting with the impulse. So I'm not really concerned with maximizing the cards I have. I'm trying to see new cards like Time Walk or Embereth Shield Mate, Shield Mate, Shield Breaker, whatever. Shield Manate. Shield Manate. How is our deck winning? Well, our game one opponent was just terrible. You call it terrible. I call us unbeatable. And we're 1-1 one, one currently, so we're definitely not unbeatable. How dare you? So if we draw blue, this is good. And if we draw any line, we can play Creamy Tarpet. Answer. Okay. I accept. Let's draw Island, Island. We'll take a tar pit now. Okay. Wow. I think that might be all of our mountains. And their mana base, I'm so jelly. Oh, yes. Nice. Australian for noise. Let's fill now. 
Don't kill my Ophiomancer. Just give me my snake. No, it's dead. You can give me my snake. Give, give me, me my snake. Yeah, that's, that's how I'm feeling. Dak Faden, huh? That's a good that's a good one. That's a real good one, man. How come they didn't give me my snake? Do you know? That's pretty good. Can Sour take their Planeswalker? Sour? What is a sour? It's a kind of candy. Oh, I don't. I don't have any. I don't think candies can take Planeswalkers. Dang it! Yeah, man. I don't know. I never heard of such a thing. Well, you let me know when you do. Sower of Temptation can't, but I don't know if those are the same things. They might be. Wow, dude. Fucking Ashiok deck every single game. Must be nice. Wow. Three creatures. All right, your move. Oh, they just plussed again. Do they have an answer for time walk? That's pretty good. Oh, Dire Fleet Daredevil, you actual scumbag. It's pretty good. It is pretty good. I think they're digging for a Mind Slaver answer, though. Yeah. What? They plussed? Instead of getting rid of my mind slaver? That can kill artifacts? Yeah, sack an artifact if you do destroy an artifact or a creature. Oh, sack an artifact. He didn't have an artifact to sacrifice. Well, that's something, all right. Oh, uh, that's... So, I mean, next turn we can use that to sack his own construct to kill the Dire Fleet, and then we can... Can Ashiok target yourself? Can Ashiok target ourself? Like, if we take his turn, can we use Ashiok on himself? Oh, we can just minus X, right, and just not get something? Yeah, we're just minus Xing, right? Okay. You might as well attack the uh, the Golami. Let's go get something good. Um, yeah, let's get Angras Rampage. Tasker for one, two, three, four. Attack. Doretti Spaghetti. Go to your turn. Oh, wow. Yeah, okay. So this is what we're going to do. This is actually brutal. Um, okay, main. We're going to play this. Resolves. Oh, then sack it, yeah. We're going to sack an artifact. Sack. Uh, let's make sure we can do this thing with... Uh, nine. Okay. Sack an artifact. Get rid of this. Wait, hold on. Oh, I think I just started it wrong. Oh, no, I didn't. Okay. 
or sacrificing that, so we're gonna get rid of this guy. Incinerate this guy. Brutal. Don't care about your island. I wish I didn't get Angress Rampage now. I got Angress Rampage because I was like, oh, I'll just use this to get rid of one of the things, but I think it's actually still fine. So we know they have an island in hand. Mm -hmm. And now we have Tasker online. Yeah, that's pretty good. Angress Rampage for anything they might be able to play. Wow. And our graveyard's empty too, so they're going to have to give us something good, probably. That was a turn, my dudes. Lava Claw? Yeah, I don't care. Sure. That's a little scary. But we're not going to... Uh, chain Lightning, because they can direct it back, kill our Pestermite. Oh. But we could direct it back again. So we could deal them 6, 79, 10, 11, 12. Yeah, we just don't have to play this turn. Right, I'm just trying to figure out what our options are in terms of like how much damage we can deal to finish them off. Yeah, I would just like Sower. I would play Sower. There's no reason not to, really. Oh, no, I was going to actually just... I was just going to actually... Manic I was just going to use Tassiger's ability. See what we hit. Oh, okay. But I'm tempted to play Mana Crypt. Yeah. Like, 1, 2, 3, activate. This is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Yeah, that seems fine. Like, we know they have Island in hand, so... Oh, they have to give us Gone to your Arena? Sure. Deal. <laughs> they played an island. Okay. Lost their last card. No, this is way. Ink Eye is just hard cast. So I get to steal that, is what you're telling me, and then I just get to kill you? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I guess we're only dealing nine. I lost the flip. Can we brain freeze them? One, two, three, four spells. So 12 cards? No. We could do it to him. I don't think it does anything. Like, I mean, it gets rid of a bunch of their cards. Yeah, but that doesn't, that's not necessarily a good thing. Like, you're yeah, just. Yeah, that's true. It's all random anyway. Wow. 2 <laughs> 0 with this deck, dude. Oh my god. I don't understand it. Oh, that's incredible, dude. Remember that time you're like, should we just, uh, if you drop, I'll donate 10. Oh, man. It is neither a Kiki nor a Storm deck. It wanted to be, and then it never was. Okay. You looking at those guys? Yeah. What are you doing, man? That's all my hair's on it. On it? Yeah. Oh, wonderful. See, this is when we lose. <laughs> the old turn one library. Sand? Yes, man. With one spell? Okay. Just make him stop. Look, there's a second spell. You happy now? Yes. Look, guys, the point is, I feel like we've pushed our luck with the 2-0 already, so. We're going to draw Thief of Sanity, and then we're going to have the perfect curve. 
Oh, look at that little guy. Okay, that's not bad. In fact, I kind of like it. Yeah, we get the Shondi out. Yeah, that's real good. And then we just kill their Pyromancer. Yeah, I like it. Every turn they just get on a land draw card, land draw card, land draw card. It's so stupid. Yeah, it's very good. It's very good. Library's freaking nuts. <sighs> Wandering Freeman will draw a card. You can also draw a card on my turn if you don't have to discard, my dude. Don't feel any pressure to have to draw the card during my turn. Or during your own turn. During anybody's turn. Don't, don't Just don't do it. We can set up a Chandra Plus here. I like that, yeah. Um, what would we get, though? One thing we could do is we can go Mystical Tutor for Dark Petition, flip Dark Petition, play the Dark Petition because we'll have Mystical Tutor and Time Walk, and then we can get like Phyrexian Arena with it and play yeah, it for free. That, right? What? Do you play land yet? Yeah, I just play land. So we don't have the mana for that. We're one dark short. Yeah, we're one short. Yeah, you're dark right. Dark is five, so. Whatever, I'll just exile and hit, hit the Dark Petition. I don't even care. Ralph Master's pretty good here. Freebie. Oh man, and he made it to combat? It's all happening. It is all happening. Wow! I wish I could do something else, but... I guess that's good enough. This is my library, Alexandria. I just got a free Goblin Realm Master. The difference is I'm doing stuff. I got a... I got stuff on the board. I got irons in the fire. They're just going to play like land through the breach and we're going to die right now. No. Sure. All these things are just feeding my, my task here, just so you know. Feed my task here. What can we mystical tutor for? Should we wait to shut it up with a shandy? To shut it up with a shandy? Yeah. And we're still setting it up, right? No, I guess not. We do oh, it doesn't matter, right? Like, whatever. We don't need it. We can just wait. Maybe we don't really need to answer anything, technically, so. Blue, 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 red, red, black, black. Let's play another black just in case. It was a mountain. Yeah, so we can anyway. two, three, one, two, three. Hmm. Well, I can't do all the things I want to do. I'd like to either attack with Tarpet or activate Tasker nor one mana shy of doing those things. I think we still play Tasker. Do you have any way to get time walk back? I don't think so, right? No, we don't. Or Rival Master, right? No. Nope. None of these cards do anything, right? No. Not for us. Um, no, that's not true actually. Like what? We have Tasker that can get back time walk. Only if they give it to us. Right. But we can kind of make it so they do. Can we? Yeah, if we hit two lands and time walk's the only card in there. Okay. There's a chance, I guess. I mean, what else are we going to do with the mana? You did an extra Larabi? I guess if he gives a Larabi back, that's fine. Right. Yeah, I don't, I don't think that's terrible by any means. Oh, what up, Sean? Sean Stoffel with Sean Mitchell. Hmm. You don't say. I, I, I do. I do. Our opponent's name is Space Cowboy Batman. Jesus. Space Cowboy Batman Jesus. <laughs> yeah, that's correct. <laughs> I think we are going to get Mana Lake here. And we're going to like wish we had a better counter spell, but what are you going to do? Can you have to reveal it? Gross. That's fine. What are they going to do? How are they going to play around that? Very easily. Oh, really? You think so? Yeah. That sucks. 
See you next time, Space Cowboy Batman. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Let's add all the blue. What we can do, I like that we can add two and then activate Chandra. Wait, what? We can add two, or not activate Tasker, rather. So it's just like a way to, like, it just lowers Tasker's cost to two. Oh, sure. Can I tell Freewood or Mystical? They're probably just going to give us Mystical Tutor again? Because it's like the most net negative card. Rabble Master. Okay. Sure. <clears throat> That's fascinating. I'm fascinated. I don't know what to make of that, especially when we have a creeping tarpet on, on board. So they only have mana leak. They're not drawing a card this time. I see. I see. It has all been revealed. I has a feel bad. Yep, and we're dead. Maybe not. No, we're dead. No, we're, we're probably dead. How do I give all my bits away when I'm talking? I don't know, actually. I don't know. What does he need a third red? Well, not for Splinter Twin. True, but it could be his friend. There you go. Now you got three red. Well, no, they. No. I don't know what's going on here. I mean, if it's just you're slow rolling the Splinter Twin, I guess they're trying to play around mana leak. We don't have. We have one mana. What the yeah, fuck? Just play your fucking card, man. There you go. Jesus. Yeah, I don't know what we could have there. I mean, I have spell. Like I have spell pierce, and days, but like. Even then, you had. I have two cards, right? Mana, so like work. you didn't need it at all. You had three mana. Yeah, I don't know why you're like playing Chrome Mox. Like, man, I actually felt like we were doing really, really good that game. Yeah, until the stupid two card combo. That is true. Until the stupid two card. Uh, do you want to maybe bring in Mind Slaver because we have like. Chain lightning, which is really bad. Yeah, that seems fine. Shieldbreaker do anything? Maybe. I mean, it's a body at worst. Yeah. <coughs> Whew. Board Pestermite, you can go twin and get them. Yeah, that's why I did. That's why I boarded it in. But how do you get them with it? If they put Splinter Twin on the guy, you just tap it. <laughs> oh, gotcha. Oh, 300 bits from Sean. Thank you so much, dude. I'm glad you figured it out. Nice. Are you ready for some football? How many bits is the thing? What's a, What? What's bits to dollar rate? A hundred bits is one. A dollar. A bit is a penny. Okay, gotcha. Oh wow, this is this is a snapper. Thank you. Oh, T Jesse with the sub. Thank you so much, buddy. We turn really... one Rabble Master. Yeah. Turn two Time Walk. <laughs> Seems good. I agree with you. Yeah, that's probably too much for them to handle. God, I hope so. I mean, I'd like a black man at some point, but, you know. I did say football, but I was just making a joke because, like, the old Monday Night Football song was like, Yo, are you ready for some football? And, like, I lost the flip. Basically did. Oh, that's interesting. That was your black mana. That is my black mana.
Come on, heads. I'm just... I'm taking more damage than they are. <laughs> Not exactly. But soon. Oh, we just win. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that'll do it. Oh, I'm just five, six, seven, eight. They go to five, and then they're like, "Well, I don't have anything to deal with that on turn two. Oh my god, this freaking! Look at they have like pyroclasm. If they're lucky, that's it. Jesus, Jesus, they all have families, Michael, and we're just murdering them left and right. Th Michael, think of their families. I guess their deck is like kind of not great, but it has a couple of really strong cards like Time Walk and Mana Crypt that kind of get us there. Bitch, please, Goblin Rival Master has been slaying. Oh, Rob is fine too. Take him on down to the goblin train. Who's <laughs> gonna get on up down to the goblin train? Have you ever gone outside and called on the goblin train? <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Have you hey man, what's your favorite football team? The rat train? That's your favorite football team? <laughs> I don't really have one. Send them on down to Rat Train. I think we just start on the Rat Train here. Yeah, we do. Yeah, we, do. we do. Send them on down to Rat Train. Have you ever been outside and got to call on the Rat Train? <laughs> <laughs> Send them on down. Which is, guys, just so you know, it's much different to go outside and call on the Rat Train than it is if you stay inside and call on the Rat Train. Two totally different Rat Train experiences. <laughs> Okay, come on, let's do that Rival Master shit again. Damn it. I think we have the Moldus. I like Fatal Push. I'm going to keep it. I believe in I believe in the heart of the cards, Michael. Ophiomancer, despite being a 2-2 that makes a 1-1. Ooh, that was a good draw. Is not a Rival Master. That's, that's like one of the best draws we could add. Can you use your Amazon Prime membership to subscribe to your Instagram? I don't know, actually. I don't think I've tried it. Be a segment. Dang. I was just trying to a segment. That's what I said. But your service just segment. If that works, that would just be like free money every month. I mean, not much, but like three. It's yeah, it's actually like three fifty or whatever. You <gasps> automatically get wow, that was good. Oh, that's yeah, that's very good. Now we're talking. I actually have a, a real clock now. Assuming the Ophium answer lives. Probably like tap out for coalition send, relic. That'd be sick. Send it on down the rat train. That would be that would be the jam. The actual jam. You gotta send them on down. Oh, they to repealed the my train. bitter blossom. That is interesting. That is something. Yeah, I think we should play the Bitter I think it's actually Ophiomancer. Like, we're going to make... Like, this is, makes more power on the board now. Yeah, that's true. And next turn we can play Bitter Blossom. And Time Walk next turn. Yeah. Like, this puts three power on the board. It's going to take three turns for us to get that much with this guy, so... That's a good point, yeah. <clears throat> Send him on down to Rat Train. Can't you just make a million Amazon Prime free trials and use the sub on your sub? Uh, yeah, you probably could, but, like, the amount of effort that would take is probably not also, worth... Also, some point out you're automatically subscribed to yourself, so you probably can't do that. Also, like, they just had to cycle Mold Drifter to hit a land drop, so that's pretty cool. Rap Master. Rap Master. Rap with Rap, 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 Rap. Yeah, Bitter Balls of Time Walk. I think we do it. Is that enough pressure? I guess we could just wait. We could I just... feel like we could just do better. Yeah, we could wait for a better turn of Time Walk. Yeah, that's true. But don't we play Bitter Blossom and just cast the Shield Breaker? I was thinking that, because if they play as much the... yeah. power on board as we can. I think that's the only way we win this game is just to try to get it over with as quick as possible. Did you find a suitable house apartment yet? No, I have not, dude. I have not. Unfortunately not. We're still looking. Trying to get our... It's a grind. God, it's a fucking grind. You ain't kidding. It's like a job that no one gets paid for. It is like a job not that no one... a job that you don't get paid for, you but, have to pay for that And job. also, if you, if you do poorly at your job, you don't have a home. Right. <laughs> so you don't get to live anywhere. And then you can't even send it down, down to Rat Train. Nahiri, you gonna get rid of my Ophium answer? No, you're gonna plus. Oh, Sean, hundred more bits, paying the bills, bits. I appreciate you, buddy. You are awesome. So we just get to go Angress Rampage, kill this, time walk, attack for a billion. Maybe we just actually attack this. How much damage is this? One, two, three, four, five, and then 
No, Angra's Rampage is not that good against them. It's sorcery speed. We should definitely just kill that and right. try to kill them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. This is eleven damage if we time walk here. You can't actually live on the rad train. It's not it's not like public transportation. Oh. Oh, we're definitely thief of sanitying. And then time walking. That seems good, yeah. Oh, that's insane. And we're all just going face here. Face is the place with the helpful hardware store. You guys know that Ace is the place song? Send them on down the right train. And time walks a messed up card, huh? I don't know what they were thinking. Take an extra turn? Yeah, two mana seems fine. Yeah, face him. Oh my god, there's four. Did it get anything? It gets Pestermite. It does get Pestermite. And we can tap one of their lands. That's actually pretty good. Well, it's not like they can win anyway next turn is the thing. We might as well go good at that, right? Well, they can't do anything next turn, right? Sack a Planeswalker. Get rid of your Nahiri. We'll just keep Fatal Push up. The only concern is they have a random wrath, but... Well, then we still get the card that we found. So, actually, maybe we leave this up, because they can't do anything next turn. Because, like, okay, so they play another land. They, they can't... They'd have to have Deceiver Exarch in order to Splinter Twin. Okay. Fascinating. Was here you have to do like alt eight? Yeah. Okay. I ain't too scared of it though. I don't like Nahiri killing this, but I think we still have enough to really like. Well, there are four. I mean, we still have lethal by far. Also, we can get um, Rabble Master, which is important. Yeah. Send them on down to Rat Train. God, I feel like that's the stream's theme song now. They're digging. They also need a second white for any any sort of like wrath. Rass, yeah. They must need to be a second red for most. Okay, just another island. Power Cosm would wreck us, but. I mean, sure. Are they going to concede here? Because this looks pretty bad. We're going to 3 0 this draft. <laughs> Holy shit. This is why you don't drop, ladies and gentlemen. You could win. I told you we we're going to 3 0 with this stupid deck. I read your initial impression on Theros Beyond. Plug here, but do you think Mono Red is going to be a safe bet? It's hard to say until we see the whole set, I think. Um, but it is good. It is it is one thing that, like, Mono Red has been a traditionally uh, a very strong... Like, the Mono Red in Standard right now is actually pretty good. So so they, if they could tap this guy down block here, they take four. So if they have any removal spell and a gentleman... Well, let's Should we play that first? No reason not to, right? Well, the problem is, like I said, if they have one removal spell, right, we get to go. They gotta go block here, remove this guy, and then they take one, two, three, four, five, block, remove. No, they're gonna go tap, tap this guy, block this guy, remove this guy, and then they take three, right? Puts in one, one, two, three, one, two, three. I almost kind of want to go get like. Well, it's only a win if like. They don't have, like, Cryptic Command. Tap our team down. Like, they could go Deceiver Exarch, three mana, untap a land, Cryptic Command, and then just kill us with... Yeah, I think this is... This feels correct. I think as long as we keep a Fatal Push, we're fine, right? Although, if they have Cryptic Command... If they go Deceiver Exarch... Untap land, cryptic command. If, like, if their hand is Deceiver XR cryptic command, like, what are you going to do? Yeah, that's what I'm afraid of. Yep, I think they're picking their modes. 
Yep, that sucks. But the problem is if we go to the, we're also like, if they have one removal spell and Deceiver Exarch, then that's also. So you either have to put them on removal spell, Deceiver Exarch, or Cryptic Command, Deceiver Exarch. And Cryptic Command's also a removal spell, so they can just, oh, that resolved. Okay, so they, oh, wow. So they're just dead, right? Well, they can Brazen Bar or Deceiver Exarch. All right, so we take the twin, right? Okay, so what's their plan here? This is actually really complicated. Hold on, we're going to attack with everything. They're probably going to play. Well, Deceiver Exarch can't block a flyer. No, it can't. So we're going to get in there for the flying guy, unless they tap the flyer, block like shield mate, right? So they block. They take care of these two, and then they take one, two, three, four, five. Well, if they play Raisin Bar, they get to bounce a guy, too, don't mm -hmm. forget, and they get to block a flyer. They need three, untap. But then we get to kill Deceiver Exarch, so I think that's actually fine. Yes. So I'm actually going to take Counterspell here. Because Splinter Twin doesn't do anything. I also do need another red. Send it on down to Rat Train. Tap the, tap, the, tap the thief. Oh, they do need another red. That's a good point. Didn't hear you, though, so there's like a decent chance they get there. Well, they could also just plus Nahiri. One, two, or, uh... Okay, so we can't win this turn, right? Because if we attack with everything, they go block here. They take one, two, three, four, five. They, they block here, bounce the Ophiomancer. And then they take three. So we might as well send two of these guys at Nahiri, so at least she can't ultimate. Uh, yeah. Actually, we want to force them to do that, though, because we want to fatal push this. Right. Exactly. And if, if they don't, if we don't lose anything, right, like they could just go take it all, then we lose nothing on board. So we actually have to go face with all, unfortunately. Right, because they block it, they take one, two, three, four, five. That forces them to bounce this. Actually, it's still lethal. Like, we still hit Neary, right? Because now they have, they're going to go block here, they take one, two, three, four, so it's still, they still have to bounce the Ophiomancer here. That seems correct, and then Neary doesn't get to ultimate. Because like, if they just have like stupid like Emrakul or something, like I don't want to deal with that nonsense. No, we could just sack all our lands. I still don't want to deal with it. <clears throat> yeah, this is actually great for us, I think. Because their hand is what? Their hand is like Splinter Twin Brazen Borrow right now. And they actually don't need... They have a second mountain and like another one of these. Because otherwise they're just dead here. Can't they just bounce the Ophiomancer? Yes, but then we get to kill this with Fatal Push because a permanent left the battlefield. Uh, yes, okay. Sure, so you're dead. And they're going to have to do it before damage, so we actually get to keep our, our Shield Breaker. Oh, because they don't have to die, just something has to leave the battlefield. Correct. Right. Yeah, gotcha. And we, yeah, that was really good. Jeez. Now I'll play Recruiter. We're not dead to Pestermite. One, two, three. Oh, yeah, we are. I mean, no, we're not. No, we're not. Because no, they, Pestermite doesn't, doesn't, doesn't work on their own turn. doesn't have haste. Yeah, Pestermite doesn't have haste. And they can't have Kiki plus something because they don't have enough red. So. Oh, because you're... Oh, you're, they were thinking, like, if they have Pestermite in the deck, they can activate Nahiri to put it into play. Oh, yeah, I guess so. But they still need another red. No, because then they just untap their mountain. Oh. I'm just going to get Pestermite here for safety. Well, I mean, we're either dead next turn or we win. So. Well, we're not dead. We, we, they can't win this turn because we they have Splinter Twin in hand. 
but their but pester yeah, might would not be right, it doesn't have haste and they can't hear you so okay, cool. they can't win this turn we know like what we know the one of the two cards in their hand so I mean they can play brazen bar to like block a fairy but that's pretty much it I think it's rather bust and with one plains and one mountain it's not looking great like you're gonna have to hit like the correct land and the correct wrath Power Cosm will get us, but well, keeping my fingers crossed, they don't have a Power Cosm. I mean, we still have Bitter Blossom on board. Like, yeah, it's not wow, really Dig Through Time seems real good. Yeah, it's like <laughs> lucky, 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 lucky. Perfect draws. Yeah, that's real good. I mean, if they don't have anything here, though, they're just dead, right? Like, their hand is Splinter Twin, so... You have to find an answer to our board in these seven cards, so... Either way, thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. You can check me out on twitch.tv slash franklapore. You can check me out on patreon.com slash franklapore. Coolstuffinc.com every Wednesday. New article went up just the other day. You can check that out. Just the other riverbend. Actually, no matter when you're, whenever you're watching this video, you can find new articles every Wednesday and use promo code FRANK5 to get 5% off. And you can check me out at manatraders.com. You'll get 20% off the first three months of any subscription. If they run big wing creatures, Nahiri, play, uh, Nahiri has, can, it can only negative seven. Okay, Nahiri's negative eight, so no. No. They, Nahiri is not live. Like, Nahiri, you can either negative two or plus two here. I mean, they can plus, if they hit, like, time walk, they can go Nahiri plus two, time walk, Nahiri negative two next turn. But, can we check out your undies? No, me undies has not been a sponsor for, like, a year and a half. Been that long? Yeah, it's been a while. I mean, if they Wrath, I have bigger concerns. Like, because they get their Counterspell back. Like, they get to go Wrath, Counterspell. But, I mean, like, they also have to have a big creature in their deck. Like, we don't know what they have. And if they do, like, like Emrakul... Also, they've been thinking forever on this dig, so... Right. It's not a super obvious choice, I guess. Or this is a slow roll of the century. One of the two. Okay, they're using Nahiri. Discarded that guy. So you know they have twin and two other cards in hand. Play they have Pestermite. To concede! Nice. 3 0 with the pile. Oh my god. So they didn't have Pestermite in their deck. I don't know if we knew that or not, but let's open this treasure chest. Wow, that was ridiculous, dudes. Oh, another scrambled dinosaur avatar and a March of the Multitudes. You can get multiple of those? I guess so. I don't know why. That That's seems weird. really weird. I don't know. Let's open these rewards packs. We got a Phyrexian Dreadnought. Oh, the thing in some decks. And a Firemind's Research. Not a thing. Not a thing in any decks. And a Doomblade. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. I'll see you next time.